I look like a person. <sighs> Good morning. It is morning. It is 11 a.m. 10.58 to be exact. My hair is down. I'm in plus size 90s fat girl model mode. I got my hair did. It's so long. Like, it's getting on my nerves. And I said to Dave today, I was like, it's getting on my nerves. He's like, well, you just cut it. And I'm like, no, you like it long. He's like, well, yeah. Because he's only ever seen me with, like, hair to, like, here. Maybe here, like, mid-nip. It's, it's literally, it's, like, this far away from, the like, the small of my back. And it's just too much. Um... I was up and out by about 10.30 this morning because I had an appointment at the DMV at 10.45. Or I thought I did. My appointment was at 10 a.m. I left at 10.30. So, there's that. Uh, so I made another appointment for the 12th, but I am going in the general direction of the DMV to pay my rent. So I may swing on through and see if they have anything, like, not available, but, like, the walk-in. You know what I mean? I'm just not in the mood to sit there and wait for an hour. Like, I'm not, I'm not playing that game. I have another 30 days until it's, like, officially illegal for me to drive without a license. So, because we have a 60-day grace period. I also need to renew my my registration, so there's that. Um, so today will be a day of paying the rent. Uh, the mister needs some coffee creamer and we're just about out of sugar. Oh, I'm sorry, did you peep the earring? Did you did you peep the earring? Because uh, them pumpkin pie bishes are back. Yes, yes they are. Yes, yes they are. Um. I have to go to World Market because they have like the fun flavors of the nut pods. That was a weird sentence, but you know what I mean. Uh, and I feel like I had to go somewhere else. I wanted to go to TJ Maxx to see if they have coffee flavors because I'm almost out of the white chocolate pumpkin. Um, I think I might go back to Publix at some point or if they have it because I might go to Walmart. Whatever store I'm in, I'm going to check to see if they have the peppermint mocha coffee from Starbucks because we do love some peppermint mocha up in this bitch. I'm also going to go to Bath and Body because I have two candles that I don't love. So I'm going to, why is that like loose? Weird. Um, so I'm going to exchange those and just kind of, uh, go about my day. I'm going to go home, take down the Halloween stuff. You just come right on over to my lane there, sweet cheeks. Clean up a little bit and then relax for the rest of the evening. Weigh-in is tomorrow. Tomorrow night is the Gabriel Iglesias show. I bought these tickets back in, like, March. Like, they, I bought these forever ago. Maybe April. And uh, I even messaged my friend, Leanna. I was like, should I buy these? She's like, yes. She goes, because if you want to see him, they're good seats. Like, I'm, we're in row two, seats one and two. So, they're really good seats. But they were expensive. I think I paid three thirty for both after you know all your fees and everything. So I don't know. I'm excited for that. I'll probably have a drink or two. The show starts at eight, so we'll probably get dinner beforehand. Uh, why does it say Southern Napa? Weird. Uh, but tomorrow's weigh-in. I don't think I did very well this week. Um, I definitely binged last night. I binged Reese's and I binged, or Reese's, sorry, uh, and I binged Kit Kats. So that's not great. That is, that is not great at all. Um, it was bound to happen sooner or later, but I'm right back on today. Um, I didn't vlog yesterday because I just didn't feel like it. And I do notice I binge more on the days that I don't vlog, like, or I binge, period. Um, so we're going to try and do it every day. Coffee. Coffee. This is six ounces of almond milk, pumpkin, Starbucks, three pumps of white chocolate pumpkin syrup, and then I took three tablespoons of the zero sugar creamer, which does not bother my stomach, and frothed it and did it as like a cold foam. I will insert a picture. 
but that's two points. Not too shabby. Didn't eat food food because I honest to God was not hungry. I also know if I'm out and about running errands, I can stop and grab something somewhat healthy. Uh, I think dinner tonight is going to be soup and sandwiches just because it's like an easy dinner. Um, next week is going to be me alone a lot of the week. Um, he leaves for Philly to go celebrate the Marine Corps birthday up there. Uh, in case you did not know, my husband is a Marine, a former Marine. Once a Marine, always a Marine. Am I right? Uh, so he used to celebrate it all the time when we lived up there because cookies, there's a bar called Cookies. I, I said that really weird. Um, and I don't know if it's still called Cookies, but the bar that is there is the bar that the Marine Corps was formed in. So every year, him, uh, Todd, which is one of his groomsmen, Tom, who couldn't make it to our wedding, and Todd's dad, and I think maybe one or two other people, all go and celebrate. They wear their kilts. You actually probably have seen the picture in a lot of my videos. It's on the ledge behind me when I'm sitting on the couch. I mean, the picture you see of all the guys in the kilts, that's the guys. Uh, they all go and celebrate. I don't know if his boss is going, he was supposed to, but what are those fuzzy things on my car? There's like more than one. Weird. Um, he leaves Tuesday morning. I have to take him over to the airport super early. So I might make him drive. I don't know. I'll figure it out. But, uh, oh shit. I might have to cancel overtime. I'll talk to him because I think I start at seven. But he's going to be on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I pick him up in Birmingham on Friday and then we go to the cabin for the weekend. So I definitely won't be vlogging next weekend after I just said I was going to vlog every day. That's really all I got for you. I binged. I'm back on. I'm drinking my coffee. I'll see you when I have food or something of substance to talk about. I got very hungry very quickly and I am in the general vicinity of a Moe's, so I stopped at the Moe's. This is diet cream soda. salsa. And then I got three soft tacos. I do not know how many points they are, but I'll tell you what I got on them. I have to do the math. I don't think they'll be probably horrible, but we have can you see? I think you can see. There is chicken, corn, Pickled jalapenos, lettuce, and cilantro. And then I got a side of guac, which is two points. I know that much. Let's taste it. It's wet and falling out all over the place. It's a damn good taco. Riddle me this. And excuse the chin. My skin is a hot mess. Riddle, riddle, riddle me this. All you cool cats and kittens. Went to Bath and Body. Exchange the two candles. There are three wicks were on sale for $15.95. Okay, you still with me? They have a candle that I know for a fact David likes. So I'm like, you know what? Wonderful. I'll get one. I got balsam and something. Tree Farm, which is the one I know he likes. He'll pretty much like anything balsam. And then I got a spiced apple toddy because I'm like, that'll take us from like now until the new year. So, fully expected to pay the $15.95 for the candle plus Alabama sales tax because it's 10 bucks or 10%. I get up there and the couple in front of me is using coupons. I'm like, I seem to remember getting coupons. Let me check my purse. Lo and behold, two coupons. Where am I going? World Market. So I have a 20% off your order, like your purchase, a $10 off a $40 purchase, and a free body care item. So I'm like, ooh, can I use this? She's like, absolutely, any body care. I'm like, body wash? She's like, yeah. So I grab the fairy tale scent. I love it. 
So now keep in mind, I'm exchanging two candles. I bought a candle and I bought a body wash. So I'm expecting the body wash, of course, to be free because it is. Then 20% off of the candle. The other two should be an even exchange. She goes and gets a gift card and goes, here you go. I'm like, I don't understand. She goes, we owe you money. I'm like, what? She goes, yeah, so since your candles were full price when you bought them, it was an exchange. She's like, so you have a credit. The candle's on sale. You had 20% off and the body wash is free. I'm like, what? And like, she explained it to me again. I'm like, I don't get it. Like, it's not just an even exchange. She goes, no. I'm like, I don't, what? And like, I could not wrap my head around it. And she just gave me the gift card and showed it to me on the receipt. And I was like, okay. I mean, who am I to question Bath and Body Works? But like, that made zero sense to me. I walked in with two candles that were burned, mind you. And I told her they were burned because mine don't look burned when they're burned because I use a warmer. And she goes, okay, this damages them out, gives me my three candles and my body wash and my $14 in credit and sends me on my merry way. Okay. Sure. Makes sense, right? So I just left World Market. Oh, I'm showing a little, showing a little. Um... I just left World Market. I spent $27, which is okay, considering I didn't spend any of the money I thought I was gonna spend it at Bath Body. But I found the nut pods. Um, Lindy, Paleo Barbie herself, had posted on her Facebook page that she found like the eggnog flavored nut pods. And I was like, I needs it. So I figured they would have it because they had the pumpkin one. So I got two of those, two peppermint ones, because I couldn't find those last year either. Then I got a bottle of wine. Reindeer Games, I think, I don't know, it's Moscato. A four ounce pour is four points. Because sometimes you just need a glass of wine. Like, I mean, am I wrong? I'm not wrong. Am I the drama? I don't think I'm the drama. Uh, and then I got a little stocking stuffer for the kid. So score for that. Those tacos were delicious. Delicious. Um, I kind of wish I had gotten the spicy chicken instead of the guac because it really didn't need the guac. Um, and you'll be happy to know I did eat four chips that came in the big bag, but then I threw the bag out. So at least I got that going for me. Having a productive day. And then my husband does fancy as he is because we go instead of saying excuse me we go um excuse so he sent me a gif of uh the character from euro trip that goes me scoozy and he just goes uh excuse where is like i'm out but i'm gonna go home because i really gotta pee and then i'll drop this stuff off i really want to try my wine though look at it it's fancy I'm not supposed, oh, electric reindeer is what it's called. I'm not supposed to drink and drive it, right? They frown upon that, yes? <laughs> I'm gonna go home. <sighs> hey, so this is to wrap up yesterday. Um, I never finished wrapping up for you guys, so you don't know what happened. Uh, nothing. <laughs> I completely just didn't finish vlogging the rest of the night. Um, so, you didn't see anything. I went home and I wound up like working on my diamond painting and we went to dinner at Beefo Brady's where I did not count points and I had candy at the movies. There you go. End of story. The sandwich I had though was divine. Absolute perfection. Could not have asked for more. It was like a French dip almost. It was prime beef or prime rib, onions, and provolone cheese. Um, maybe, maybe you wave and teach your children. There you go. Um, it was prime rib, provolone cheese, onions, and then you dipped it in like on like a garlic ciabatta and then you dipped it in like an au jus. It was so good. So, so good. And as a result, you guys know, I am up 0.6 pounds between that and all the candy this week. It is what it is. 
Next week will be a little bit better. I hope, I think, you know what? No, I know. I'm gonna stay out of the candy. The only downside to this week is I do not have time to meal prep today. I didn't wake up until noon. And you know what? We'll talk about that in the next video because I, I wanna have some sort of, of clip for you. You know what? We're gonna go the back way. I enjoy going the back way. Um, but anyway, long story short, I ate like crap last night. We went to the movies, we went and saw The Eternals. <laughs> Wasn't my favorite Marvel movie, a little slow. Um, and now I'm up 0.6 pounds. It is what it is. I will see you guys in just a little bit to start like a little clippy on today's vlog. You can hold your horses there, sir. Hold your horses.